You've won again. Do you think that's uh, to do with Brexit or your policies in general? Well, naturally, I'm delighted to have won again with an increased majority. I think that, yes, Brexit was an important element into this election, getting it sorted, getting it done, people were frustrated. But I also think that uh, Jeremy Corbyn and the kind of threat that he would have to this country with those uh, 1970s Marxist policies were also a big danger for people. As well as that, I think I have got a very strong local uh, delivery record over the last two and a half years. What do you say to Labour and Lib Dems comments about this being because of tactical voting and it being the two way for anti-Brexit mm -hmm. and only one way for Brexit? I think there were a whole array of reasons that people voted for one party or another. But in our system, the person that wins the most votes wins the seat on the agenda and the manifesto that they set out and that's what I've done. Do you think you could have done anything better? Um, I think in this election we have worked flat out and we have got a tremendous result winning this seat for the second time with increased majority. Um, I'm sure that uh, in the fullness of time we will look back on what we've done but also the fact you've got to remember it is a winter election and time was limited and the weather also limited some of the campaigning activities that we would have done um, if it had not been uh, in December and in May or even June. When you get back to London, what's the first thing you're going to have to do? Um, well, I'm hearing reports that we are going to be uh, kept in London for an extended period uh, over the Christmas period to start getting on with that Brexit legislation. So what we've promised in an election, we will deliver in Parliament. And do you think Europe's going to make it awkward for you? Um, I think the Prime Minister's already shown what a success he can be in Europe, getting that withdrawal agreement reopened, negotiating a better deal, and getting a lot of good support and goodwill from the countries of Europe as well, because they want to get it done as much as we want to get it done. Well, good luck, and we look forward to seeing you and your promises later on in the year. Thank you.